FC25 is here and expectations are high with the second release of EA Sports' new standalone football series. Last year was impressive even with much skepticism after their departure from FIFA and we expect nothing less with this year's release. Even more, we will be playing in 4K 120fps on Boosteroid's Ultra Tier. Let's lace up our cleats and get ready for the pitch. Welcome to the club. In order to play FC25, we will be using the install and play feature on Boosteroid. We'll click play and Boosteroid will begin the install. After the install finishes, take note as you will have to log into your EA account in order to play. We will also take advantage of Boosteroid's connection test which is a solid indicator of how well our session will go. From here, FC25 will load and we can begin our gaming session. Of course, as you all know, before we do any actual gaming, we're going to check out our graphic settings. In the booster rate game launcher, I set our FPS to 120 and I turn on our stats counter so we can keep an eye on how well our stream performs. In the in-game graphics menu, we can see that our resolution is set to 4K 120 FPS with VSync off. Now, this is the Ultra tier, and we want to see truly what Booster Roy can handle, so of course we're going to follow suit and set everything to Plus Ultra! Now, from my gaming experience, EA Sports in recent years has done its best to give as close to a realistic visual experience as possible in its sports titles. We see this for an absolute fact and beyond with FC25. FC25 is a beautiful game visually, and you see that from the very beginning in the intro. From the close details in player movements to their likenesses and lifelike crowd animations, you really think you're watching the actual match at times. Everything is very colorful with great lighting. I could definitely see myself watching online matches for fun. Playing in 4K is truly the best way to play, and the FC series continues to close the gap between virtual and live gameplay with each of these titles. Booster Rate didn't have a single problem during my session. The game didn't stutter, I didn't experience any latency, and I maintained very close to 120 FPS consistently. I've only played so much for our review, but as a growing football fan, this is definitely a game I will be revisiting. Overall, FC25 on the Booster Roy Ultra tier is definitely the way to go as far as I'm concerned. I have no complaints whatsoever, other than the fact that I need more practice. With that being said, if you enjoyed this review of FC25 on the Booster Roy Ultra tier, leave us a like. If you haven't already, consider subscribing and join our Discord or become a member of the channel. Now that you've seen how well FC25 plays on Booster Roy Ultra, how about you check out how well it performs with another visually stunning game. God of War Ragnarok, at the only place where you can do battle in gaming heaven, Cloud Gaming Battle.